I did grow up here. Um, spent my summers here since the mid-1960s. My parents had a cabin. There's a certain wildness about it. If you walk through it, you just got the sense that, you get the sense that there's an animal watching you, which is kind of nice. You feel close to nature and in solitude. This particular spot uh, is perennial flow. It's the headwaters of the Hacienda River. It was first surveyed and, and begun mining and other activities in the early 1900s, long before there was any environmental regulation. So typically, like you see here, mine waste was just dumped downhill, and downhill is where streams are. I was sad to see the water so orange. It's a pretty classic representation of mine drainage. And then finally we called ADEQ. I actually met them out here when we were doing soil samples uh, for the first time. This site was in planning for about two years uh, for us to identify what the, the remedial solution was going to be and how to get equipment in and out and, and what, what the best approach would be. Once that planning was done, the actual project takes six to eight weeks depending on the site. That was massive equipment. That was I mean, <laughs> huge trucks. I was surprised they could make it in here. This particular pile was graded rather steeply because it was just dropped in place and then eroded over time. So they had to actually use uh, their excavator equipment in creative ways to, to manage this site. It cost us about half a million dollars, $500,000, to be able to remediate this site. It was, it was a really good experience. Uh, you guys held to your word. You started, you finished on time. You did what you said you were going to do. And you were easy to work with. We've only done one sample so far, uh, but the, the, the metals in that sample are significantly down from where they're before. The wetlands right in front of the uh, tailings pile they have no color. They look clear. It's promising that over the next few months, as we take additional samples, uh, that this water body will start meeting surface water quality standards. The process of working together was real important, and the goal was the same. We both want clean water.